What's up guys? Wannabe racer here, or should I say wannabe commuter. Just riding into work and taking this opportunity to check out the Coros Omni Smart Cycling Helmet. Cycling helmet that's packed with some smart features to enhance safety. All right, these safety features included non intrusive audio, uh, which uses bone conducting speakers that sit just in front of your ears uh, rather than having earbuds in. This allows you to listen to music, take phone calls, as well as turn-by-turn -turn navigation via the Koros app um, as part of the ability to take phone calls. Uh, there is a microphone that is just built into the front of the helmet, tucked away from the wind. on the smart helmet also comes with a handlebar remote which allows you to accept or reject phone calls increase the volume um, as well as skip tracks the Corps Omni also has a pair of LED light banks on the back of the helmet that automatically adjusts based on the time of day. And the final big safety feature on the Chorus Omni is that it can sense impact and send a message to uh, your emergency contact via the, the app tell them that there was an accident as well as provide the GPS location. you to uh, track your rides and upload them to Strava or Map My Ride, as well as input routes to use with the turn by turn navigation feature. I was pleasantly surprised at the performance of the Omni as a helmet. Um, I expected Coros to have cut some corners with the helmet itself in order to keep the price down while still fitting in all the smart features. The fit of the Omni works really well with my head and the ratcheting retention system had small enough increments that you could really dial in the fit of the helmet. Also the straps uh, felt secure, I experienced no slipping issues, and the extra length was managed really well. I wouldn't describe the Coros Omni as a premium helmet. It's probably more comparable to other companies' mid-range offerings, and all that smart tech does come with a weight penalty. Now onto the audio quality of the Chorus Omni. Felt more like having two little speakers in front of your ears uh, rather than actually uh, having bone conducting audio. In order to have the pods actually stay in contact with the jawbone, um, the straps would have to be uncomfortably tight. The quality of the audio is definitely what you would expect, uh, since it did end up seeming more like two little speakers in front of your ears. The sound quality wasn't as good as like a set of earbuds, but by keeping your ears free of obstructions, uh, the Coros Omni kept you aware of your surroundings. I was able to hear the cars around me, uh, even the birds and the wind. Uh, next, I was also very surprised by the sound quality of the microphone in the helmet. Um, I was really expecting that to kind of sound like talking on your phone while driving your car with the windows open, uh, but the voices were really clear without having to yell, um, and there was no wind noises. And finally, many of the safety enhancing features of the Omni are uh, well thought out. 
something like the impact sensor and automated messages is obviously a good idea, particularly for those who go riding a lot by themselves, and also anything that increases visibility like the rear lights is always a good idea as well. Talking about the lights, I think it would be a good idea for Koros to add maybe a couple forward-facing lights um, as well as they might be able to implement some sort of turn signal system uh, that can be activated using the handlebar remote. But I don't know if drivers would actually pay attention to that. In conclusion, I think the Koros Omni Helmet is a solid option. Uh, while it might not be the helmet that you would wear to a race or showing up at the group ride fashion show, um, it would be a great option for the daily rider, like a commuter or someone who does a lot of riding by themselves because of the added safety features. Anything that enhances safety is a good idea in a helmet, um, as well as the helmet itself performed very well. And while some improvements could be made to the audio and how the bone conducting pods function, as well as some of the layout of the buttons of the remote, I would still definitely recommend this helmet if you were looking for some ways to increase your safety on the bike. Thanks for watching this video on the Koros Omni Helmet. I'm uh, just curious to know what you guys look for when you are shopping for a new helmet. Uh, let me know down in the comments. As well, if you're interested in more details on the Koros Omni, you can check out the full review over on the Wannabe Racer website. I'll provide a link down in the description uh, where you can find more pictures as well as a more in-depth review of the helmet. And once again, thanks for watching. If you enjoyed the video, please give it a thumbs up like, and also subscribe for more weekly videos from the Wannabe Racer. Thank you.